Hello and welcome to episode 147 of Vokta Gaming. I am your host, the vocal terrorist Jesse Rain, and we're here with our final game for this week, game three of the best of three series between these two players. First up, our Red Zerg, the creator of the universe, the single greatest player of all time at any game ever, and also the tallest man in the world. His name is I am Nesty, and opposing him is our Protoss player in the yellow. His name is Startail Squirtle. Oh yes, it is an absolute sweat box in my room today. I am so tired because it was too hot to actually sleep. So for the first time ever, you may hear some strange noises on this cast because I have a fan on, I have the door open and I have the window open since my family and my neighbours will just have to deal with the fact that I am incredibly loud. Now it looks like Squirtle wants to do his Forge Fast Expand yet again. Squirtle just going to check all this stuff out. Nothing from Nesty so far. Uh, he hasn't got the money saved up for a hatchery so we know he's going pull. And there it is. Get scouted by Squirrel. Nice place to put it, but still gets seen. So that's pretty much it. Nest T opening the same as he always does. Squirrel opening the same way as he always does. It's worked out for each of these men one time so far. The question is, who will it work out for today? So, time to do a couple of announcements. Same as ever. Don't forget you can find me every Friday. Over at youtube.com forward slash vapor game, doing some quick low level analysis. Nice move here by Squirtle, blocking with the pylon. Gonna force Nest T to make it the third base instead of the second base. So it delays that hatchery and it makes it harder for Nest T to, to defend it against any aggression. As we see, the hatchery goes down now and the nexus goes down. So, really nice timing there from Squirtle. Worked really well, did exactly what he wanted it to do. Mm. Uh, we have four Zerglings making now, the first four Zerglings. Completely normal from Nasty. Uh, and as well as Vapor Game, you can find me now over at EasyStarcraft.com along with a bunch of other casters and some really really good replays and strategy stuff it's a brilliant website it's been up for about 48 hours now and it's just absolutely incredible and uh, they totally love my stuff so I'm not biased in any way when I say it's the best thing since sliced bread so Nest T moving across the map with these four Zerglings getting a nice bit of map control making a Roach Warren at home nothing non-standard nothing weird uh, gateway going up for Squirtle, again, everything so standard. Getting the first two gases, the Nexus is going to finish, the Gateway is going to finish, he's got a Forge and one Cannon, he's safe from Zerglings. Does need to be careful for any Roach pressure that should come. Uh, the form of Roaches, interesting that Nasty is not making any drones, it's only on 16 drones. Okay, hmm, where have we seen this before? Nesty versus Stefano. Only making two bases, but not making any drones. Okay, Nesty is going all in here. He's making nothing but spe uh, Zerglings and Roaches. Oh, man, if Squirtle does not see this coming. Right now, Squirtle knows about these three lings, and that is it. Okay, he sees the fourth. But this is normal. This is exactly what you see from a Zerg. And at home, he's not dropping any cannons because he doesn't know anything's up. Oh, Nest T is going to take this. This is going to be tough. His roaches moving across the map. His Zerglings joining them. Oh, and he's going Stargate. This is the worst possible reaction to this. Oh, there's too many units for the Stargate to kill. He needed to be adding gateways and cannons. Oh, Squirtle doesn't know it's coming. Does he know yet? Now he knows. Now he knows. Oh, my God. Squirtle is dead. He doesn't have any defensive units at this point. He has one Stalker against this entire army. He's pulling his probes. Oh, but it's not going to be enough. Nesty going straight up into the main base. Nesty is going to absolutely destroy Squirtle today. Brilliant play from Nesty as always. Such a brilliant, brilliant player. 
but this stalker is going to die. All the probes are dead. Squirtle GG's. Nesty takes the best of three. Two games to one. Absolutely incredible. Wow, what a short game for a Friday. Nesty, man. Totally fooled Squirtle. That Stargate is the worst possible tech to go against that kind of attack. Because even if you get a Void Ray out, it takes forever for the Void Ray to kill them. It can destroy all of your probes before the Void Ray has finished killing them all. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I've been your host, the vocal terrorist, Jesse Rain. I'll be back next Tuesday with some Planescape Torment. I'll be back next Wednesday with ever more StarCraft 2. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you all have a gorgeous weekend, especially if you're experiencing this weather like I am.